Welcome back to Comet. Hopefully it won't crash in my base. That would be problematic. It's hit the ground. Let's head there quickly and see what we can learn. Uh, one thing's for sure. Uh, we have enough ammunition now to stand whatever they have to throw against us. A new technology has been developed. New blueprints are available for crafting. Something flew up there. I have no idea what or why. Oh, this Gazius. Maybe it's not a wise idea to open up diplomatic relations between. Ah! A gas! And something that blows up! Everything is at max. I mean, um, I have to, to, to admit, of course, that um, this running on a 3090 uh, ray tracing at max and everything. So, uh, this is definitely not um, non GPU. Damn. Commanding. Damn. Like, what is this? What the heck? Well, it does not have a rocket launcher. 50,000. Yeah. Wait, what? Minus nine? What? Okay. Ah, because I sh I'm shooting rockets. I guess that's... Expensive I have stuff. depleted.
how much is there in terms of a second Uh, resource. Is it worth creating an, a base? 5,000? No. That's not worth the hassle. The hassle. And. The big one. Oh. Technology has been developed. New blueprints are available for crafting. Right, geothermal vents. We could use those. There's one. There are a few of those. We could use that. Um. Warning! A large group of creatures is gathering near our base. Yeah, Prepare for an incoming attack. Uh, Rift magnetized to bell it. No. Where was our geothermal power plant? Produces energy and mod. I mean, there's infinitely amount of. So that's perfect, really. Okay, there. Uh, oh, a big attack on that front. Okay. Uh, we must be ready for danger. Hostile oh, creatures are approaching our base. Get ready for battle. Uh, we should um, use that resource. 
Is that 10,000? Is it's not much. It's up down here. How much is that? <laughs> There's something special. 22,000. Now that's that's more like it. The ground is shaking. It looks like an earthquake is coming. The earthquake is over. It looks like it unearthed an object near its epicenter. Now we need ironium. Yeah, that's why I can't upgrade buildings. Yeah. Base is under attack. Energy connector has been destroyed. A new technology has been developed. New blueprints are available for crafting. Interesting. It appears that this life form contains large amounts of hazanite in crystallized form. If we can gather more samples of this species, we could learn how to obtain larger quantities of hazanite to craft better equipment and weapons. We can use the orbital scanner to search for larger population. Research completed. Uh, Maxonic sensor standard. Okay, why not? And um, proximity mine minigun. Oh, mini. Yes, please. Sword advanced. I mean, sure, why not? Liquid weapon, energy weapon, high caliber stair, yes. And um, liquid resource, headquarter level 5. Artillery tower, yes. Flame tower, plasma, let's go. Biomass energy, yes. And carbonium energy, yes. And liquid, yes. Stations of this life form. Their presence should lead us to large quantities of hazenite. That's an excellent idea, Mr. Riggs. Our equipment sure could use an upgrade. Orbital scanning finished. Potential hazenite rich location detected. I have marked the rift jump coordinates on the orbital scanner interface. That was super fast. It looks like there's a lot of these plants or mushrooms or whatever we should call them nearby. We can work on proper categorization as soon as we study more samples of the species.
5,000? Is that a joke? What is that yellow fish symbol on the ground? Ah, mines. Okay, okay, okay. Fine. Uh, we have to expand sooner or later. Maybe sooner than later. Maybe just without protection. Just let them excavate. Um, the monsters attack this and destroy it. Who cares? is under attack. What? That escalated quickly. Alrighty, so we have our advancement in technology so we should be able to wait give me a second the only thing we need right tower ammo factory do we need one of those no. um we can advance to another place cobalt mining outpost establish a permanent cobalt mining outpost within the tropical zone Rich deposits of carbonium and ironium have also been detected in this area. Threat level high. Oh boy. Maybe... Let's go with threat level low for now. Acidic Plains Reconnaissance. Palladium has been detected in a strange planetary biome. Biome that is covered by dense acidic clouds. Search the area for new resources. And gather data on the sources of the acidic emissions. Okay. I can do that. Jump successful. Environmental scanning in progress. Ashley, my senses are indicating a highly acidic atmosphere composition. 
Fluoric acid condensation is definitely abnormal compared to what we've seen in other parts of the planet. Something must be emitting the acid straight into the air. Let's look around to see what we can find. I really like the diversity of these monsters. I mean, that's so many. Yeah. Okay, let's go there to see what is causing them. <laughs> oh, that's a big boy now. Oh. A new technology has been developed. New blueprints are available for crafting. sudden change in air humidity and wind speed. A fog is forming up. It's hard to see anything in this fog. It's also affecting our solar panels and wind turbines. We have to wait it out.
The fog is clearing up. This will make things easier for us. The acidic fumes are much denser near this growth. This thing must be responsible for the highly corrosive atmosphere in this area. This life form is multiplying very rapidly. It is subdividing its cells, similarly to Earth-based beasts. The fluid inside these cells is highly corrosive. Please keep a safe distance. Uh, ah, I was about to say, can I kill it? But yes, I can. Oh, well, I, I, I was about to ask. There must be much more of this acidic yeast growing here. The orbital scanner report indicated that this entire biome is covered in these fumes. We should study it further before setting up a permanent outpost in this area of the planet. Ashley, I strongly suggest using a bioscanner to gather samples from these life forms. The fluid inside them is a highly condensed acid that can easily burn through my armor. The bioscanner will allow us to gather samples from a safe distance. Amazing. These red crystals are really huge. Look at how the light is scattering below their surface. It's mesmerizing. Uh, they also contain a lot of rhodonites. We can use this mineral to construct high-powered laser emitters for our weapons as well as other equipment. You already had me convinced at lasers. We definitely need to learn more about these crystals. We should research rhodonite handling as soon as possible. I wonder where yeast is, we can find yeast. Apparently not here. A new technology has been developed. New blueprints are available for crafting. Detecting intense seismic activity. A strong earthquake is coming. The earthquake's epicenter is near our position. It will deal serious damage to all our buildings in that area. the yeast sample. Okay, 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 okay. We need to burn it.
The earthquake is over. The tremors are getting weaker and weaker. We should quickly repair whatever's been damaged. A new technology has been developed. New blueprints are available for crafting.